Century Blues, uh, off the 20th Century Blues album. Using my Fender Blues Junior here, uh, the OCD, drives about 12 o'clock, tone is about 10, and the volume is really low. It's early here. It's, it's only uh, it's about quarter to eight. And it's Saturday. I don't want to... <laughs> Wake any neighbors up. Um, okay, uh, here we go. This is the intro. You, you start on the 14, uh, I'm sorry, 12 14 slide on the A string. Or you gotta just slide up from nowhere, just land on the 14th fret. Then you, excuse me, bar the D and the G string. I slide down. When I slide, I usually use my little finger, and this I, I usually slide on the A. A lot, most people slide on the E, but I, I slide on the A. So it's open E, G, A, B, right up. This is different. This way is different than I played it in, in the opening because uh, I, I had a little problem with this uh, with this this um. Getting it, I'm out of tune here. Excuse me, guys. I have a little snark tune on there. These things are the bomb. I'm right. These strings are brand new. These are Diderio. I mean, uh, these are Fender XL 250 nine gauge strings. I always use nines. I know I'm a lightweight. Um, but I got a bunch of them off eBay. They were on sale. I don't remember where I got them from, but uh, three sets for like three sets for I think it was six ninety nine shipped, and it came with a Fender baseball. It was pretty cool. I bought a mess of them, so it comes out to like two something a set, right? Two four six. Yeah, I don't know. Two less than three dollars a set. Way less than three dollars a set. Two something a set. Two. I don't know. Not doing math this early in the morning. Okay, anyhow, let me get back to the lesson. I'm sorry about that, guys. Get, all right. Here's the way I do it. Open G. Open then the uh, E note here in the uh, second second fret D string. And a pull off. Okay, that's that's the first part, and there's only one more part, and we'll be done. Then, <coughs> excuse me, open A, and then uh, that's an A note here again. But when you hit this A note, it's going to go between the G and the A here on the D string. When you hit the A note on the, on the seventh fret with D string, you want to hit the open A with it, okay? Not when you're on the G note, so it's... memory I haven't listened to the song in a while and the song is also tuned down to uh, D you know you turn to the D string and every, everything's tuned down a whole step I'm tuned down a half step by the way I don't remember if I mentioned that then the last part is D string from seven to nine up one two three then twelve nine on the G string and I think the solo does like a not a lot to the song. It was a fun song to play. It's a killer. E7 
seven sharp nine without without the little finger. I'm only playing four strings. Strings sound good. All right, guys. Uh, if that comes out good, I'll upload it and uh, be back with something. Something soon. Take care, all. We'll see you.